Nephi, he uh, was righteous and um, always listening to his parents, always putting the Lord first, and um, yeah, I want to be like him one day. Nephi is strong in faith. Got the brass plates, so uh, he's faithful, he listens. He was a righteous man, and we follow what our leaders do and their examples. As he says on verse Nephi 3 7, I will go and do the things which the Lord had commanded. Laman and Lamuel, like they didn't listen, even though they saw the angel and um, Miracles, they, uh, they still remember it. Even though the Lord commanded him to do a lot of um, dangerous things, he did it. Obedience to me is um, doing what you're told to do and um, doing it right. Um, and not like waiting for the person to ask you twice. Um, yeah, that's obedience to me. Nephi and Nehi were out in the wilderness, and uh, Nehi asked Nephi to go get the golden cakes to retrieve them from the city. Um, to me, Nephi shows his obedience by doing it, and also so showed his obedience to God. Therefore, he was successful. You take this, go ahead, Solomon. Right down the back of their feet there, and get it. turn it inside out, and hit it against the feet and get rid of it. One Saturday, Bishop asked us to, um, if, oh, as a ward, if we could clean up the chapel. Um, and a lot of people came. What's and um, it was like a hard job because the chapel, um, like, it hadn't been clean like, for ages. <laughs> and even though like, I had to clean the toilets and all that, it was um, fun being with everyone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wash the dishes and it. <laughs> Somehow they look at us as our future leaders and it's good for them to look up to us. As they grow up, they become like us and they go through the same thing as we do. Well, they face a lot of trials in their life, uh, struggles with parents and listening to parents, probably trials at school and with their peer group. Sometimes I feel that the commandment is a burden and they limit my freedom. Sometimes it's hard to keep the commandments. Yeah, I try. Yeah. <laughs> I think the blessings of obedience that I've gotten throughout my life is um, because I 
becoming the man I am, I am today. To me, it's like when a girl on the rugby field, and, uh, I showed my obedience to my coach by going out there and doing my best. Therefore, I was successful. But if we all show our obedience, then we will all be successful. And from Nephi, that will help me the most. I know that um, by being obedient and to our leaders and keeping that commandments, the Lord will help us in whatever and whatever we, stuff we need. Friends is a is like a big thing in young people's lives. So we need to find good friends and they have the same standards as us. I know that the Lord commands us to be obedient because um he wants us to be just like him. And this helps me um, do things that I think is hard and overcome my fears in that. So, if we keep to the iron rod, we may fill our promises. And Find friends out there that are um, helpful. They know what they need and they can help them for their child and um, <clears throat> their temptation, I think. Uh, make the right decisions. Choose the right, even when it's hard. Because if they are obedient, uh, especially to the Lord and keeping the commandments, and if they're making sure they're in the right places, such as seminary and mutual and at church on Sundays, then their testimonies will be strengthened and they will become better people and they will be examples to those around them and they will be uh, like Nephi and his example in their lives. Come back! Jai Hu!